Now this is something that I used to quite enjoy on the uh, on the Commodore 64. I'm sure it was out on the Commodore 64. It seems a bit more girly than what I remember. And I don't mean that in a sexist way. I just mean, all right, colourful then, you know. Right, so you can produce your own. Produce your own ladders. Extra game. I think... Right, okay, I'm clearly fucking dead. I thought... If you held them, yeah, you if you if you held on to them, you could bash them back and forth. Ah, you have to keep pressing the button. Right. a bit better, isn't it? Oh, what? Ah, so even in death... No, your mom. I don't remember this being ever this cutesy. I'd use cutesy then, rather than girly, in case there's any girl gamers out there going to have a go at me for disrespecting them or something. I think this is one of those bubble bobble type uh, games. You know, from the bubble bobble family, then. So you had Bubble Bobble, Parasol Stars, I think it was. Although one of them didn't come out on the Commodore 64 because the guy had his flap broken into. And, um... Oh, I didn't put any credits in. Oh, right. Yeah, a guy had his flap broken into. They stole his computer, or plus all the... The game. They even had the artwork for a... Commodore 64 box for Parasol Stars, all made up because I was going to order it from my mum's catalogue. But we tried to order it and they just said we can't do it. Here, take this. It's a boob massager.
Oh, so you kill right? Do you know I've been doing this all wrong? I thought you had to collect all the flowers, and that's how you you got to kill all the baddies, and then you progress. You know what? No, I'm not going to continue. That's just way too confusing. All right, and that's Rodland. I think Rainbow Islands was the other game. Rainbow Islands, Rodland, Bubble Bubble, Parasol Stars, I think. I might even go looking for them now. <laughs> 